It's the porky puff nibbling bug. It took quite a liking to the crunchy stuff after munching down out of date's leg. Unleash the quacks. This opportunity slide. He thanks you for dealing with another world eater. You're halfway there. He's got word out of date spotted Looper Lupin and has a feeling your time has come. He hopes you're up for it. Even though you're good hearted, you shouldn't miss this opportunity to confront the predator. Just head back to the foot of the tree. 
Fingers crossed Looper Lupin will stay put until you're there. Got word you found the greatest glider of all, an ark, and it's all good to go. Can't imagine how that would feel, to zoom so fast. Funny that you found an ark when you don't need to go anywhere in it. The world's still going to be here. Proud of you for thinking about helping before escaping, by the way. Wonders if there are any open seats left in that fancy arc glider of yours. So, what we have here is an opportunity to help your next. There's a seat open on the arc should you want to offer it as a gesture of appreciation. Why? You don't need anyone else but yourself and me, of course, but I'm a part of you, so that doesn't count. If you want to go quickly, go alone. If you want to go further, go together. The only one we'd want to get away quickly from here is darkness. But you know you can't go on without me. Even if I'm bad company, I complete you. Hmm. I think we can finally agree on something. It is better to be alone than in bad company. But best of all, is being good company yourself. Feels thrilled to snag a seat in your ark. Can't wait to glide through the skies. Goop knows he's repeating himself, but can't help talking to you. Says you'll see each other later. That's a hope hall. Some used to go there every week to join hands and hope together. Not so much hope to go around these days. Hold on. Go on, catch it. It's time to create your own path. Out of date says the time has come for you to reconcile with your past. Loma Utolu Ba Luo. Lupa Lupin is still staying in the camp where he was brought up. He hopes you'll find the answers you are looking for there. Loma Utolu Ba Luo. Even though darkness is a part of your nature, he suggests you try to keep your cool, as the best fighter is never angry. He'll point you in the right direction, but the rest is up to you. This part of the journey is one you'll have to do on your own. Lupa Lupin's camp has always been there, hidden deep inside the mountains. Out of date hopes you'll find your way and the answers you were looking for once you're there. He knows he said it before, but the time has come to put an end to the Lupin's reign of terror.
Yatu Yao Mawa, Ebazo Dombubu Yukoye. You should get over there. Come face to face with destiny. It's going to be you against the Lupin. No rules. Ayamu Raya. He's happy to help. Lupin's camp has always been there, hidden deep inside the mountains. Too bad, but all days must come to an end. Tread carefully here. This is Looper Lupin's camp. says he's been looking for us at this moment. He wanted you to come here and see for yourself where it all started. He was so little when your mother and kin came here to put an end to his mother just because she was different, a hunter. That night, the hunter became the hunted, trapped with nowhere to run. He says your mother showed no mercy. Only vengeance. He can see that you're not like your mother. There's something different about you. Maybe you would have made a better decision than she did and let them be. They orphaned him, left him alone, an outcast and a freak. Lupa Lupin says he's been reliving the moment every night since then. He says your mother and her disciples started something that couldn't be undone. They created the monster he would become. He knew his time would come and he was patient. So, when he got news about your birth, he knew how to get revenge that would last. That's why he spared you that night he raised the village when you were a child. He wanted you to suffer for life, like he had. He marked you for life, so he'd recognize you when you met again, and you'd eventually remember where you came from. His hunger grew insatiable over the years to come. He tried, but being vegetarian wasn't in his nature and he couldn't go hungry. But he's never taken a life for the sake of appetite. It's always been about survival, and that our true self is being who we are. A deep look into nature will make you understand everything better, and that natural selection eliminates, and the strongest survive. Fate is for those too weak to determine their own destiny. And now, the time has come for you to accept yours.
This might be the end of everything as we know it. Out of date says that from what he's heard, you've been busy. Waiter, Godno. Mao Mao ya. Oloi bo bo paweg. He says he appreciates what you've done so far, but unfortunately he's got urgent news from his friend Noko in the east. Vunko vuntu. Loa tolu tum. Out of date says that even though he's unsure about your intentions, he hopes you'll support Noko. He says he'll point you in the right direction, but finding Noko and making sure she gets what she needs is up to you. That doesn't sound good. Out of date was spot on. The hoof puff needs to be stopped. Out of date says that Noko is worried now that the Eastern World Eater is stepping up its activity. He explains that Noko keeps a fabled steed that she has planned to ride out to the World Eater, but needs help to get it prepared. Out of date suggests that you should head east as fast as possible and see what you can do to help. He's happy to help. To why? Says good. Keep focused on what you can do today. Tomorrow's already gone. You almost slipped past the village of Flibberdit.
Monsters sleep here, and they're just as messy as you guess. You have some key energy. This is all about you. Whether you succeed or fail, it's on you. Keep you dry at least. Find us keepers. That's a little too much for you yet. It's far away. Juju's shop is here somewhere. Let's see. Anihiloto. Tumma. Sehindi. Manneun Balgion. Juju is just thrilled to finally meet you. Even in these darkest days, when the spotlights are growing dim, you're like a fresh outfit. Don't drag. Claims to make clothes that help you make a statement about who you are. Bolton Dangly. Thinks you have the power to steer the fate of the world one way or the other. He wants you not only to save it, but to look fabulous doing so. Bolton Dangly. Boom job. He knows you have the heart of a hero. He just wants you to look like one, too. He tells you to dig deeper into your past and remember how it's all stitched together. You need to follow that thread to figure out who you are and where you're going. Wonders if you ever think about how things might be if you'd chosen one style over another. It's amazing how even a single switch stitch in the right spot can change things. Figures that's good because your suit suits you so well. Likes how the world seems to be getting its act together. Been sliding down too long. 
Both kusums to you, sir. Thanks you for darning up the whole holes in the world. It's not a perfect world, but it's the only one that fits. Kojigan thinks it's good you're working with the myriad. The Sifu there has the best taste in styles. Claims to have made his favorite, the one the Sifu wears every day. But that's enough about them. He wants to talk about him. He wonders if you can see it too. The common threads that have sewn everyone together through the years. They're all broken. But fortunately, he's good at smoothing things over, choosing things that are chic and glossing the aesthetics. Most come here to get relief from how ugly the world has become. He works a lot with mood, be it good or bad. Says we bury our dead in their best, not their worst. Why should the end of the world be any different? Some even think what he does is magic, changing the way you feel with style. That's how he got his nickname, Juju. He's been zigzagging all night. He has a fiber he needs to get done, but he's run out of bobbin. Now his reputation is hanging by a thread. He needs to thread the needle, but the only spare bobbin he knows about, well, he saw it attached to a kite flying free in the wind. He'll do what he can for you if you get him that bobbin. Boat and Tangly says you'll get it all stitched up in no time. Juju says it's fantabulous to see you again. Juju says it's fantabulous to see you. Juju says it's fan. Even up in the mountains, you can't touch the sky. This region is known as the Knup Stones. You can't find a harder place in the world. Finally found the village of Bumlidoff. Let's see. It's a monster lair for sure.
you have a chance to change the future for good or bad. Hey, there's some e-waste. the key that fits. Oh, that's rare. That's an upsy dumps. Good for learning how to haul up. Don't see that in the shops. You can't really understand your story till it's done. Says there's an interesting place nearby that no one knows about, but doesn't really want to talk about it right now. Says you look trustworthy. Might as well tell you where it is. Focus on the tightrope. It soars like a kite, so it better be one. Latch onto it before it flies away. Reel that in. Juju will be pleased to see you manage to get hold of a bobbin, even though it's the unconventional kind.
That's well. Someone set up camp in a tree. There's a serenity about this spot. <laughs> 